Hi friends, in this session, I am going to explain about MinA function in Power BI DAX. This is one of important DAX function in Power BI reporting. If you are watching first time my video, please subscribe and like my channel and also share with your friends. Why? Because in this channel, I am providing complete training of Power BI from beginning level to advanced level and also interview questions, real time project explanation with scenario based monthly updates, much more updated in this channel. If you follow my classes from class 1, you will definitely will get the job and also easy to survive in real time environment. So in this video, we will deep dive about Minia function in Power BI DAX. Before going to implementation, let me explain what is Minia function in Power BI DAX and what is the syntax of Minia function and what are the examples provided by Microsoft Power BI team. Let me go to my browser to understand Minia function. Let me open official page of Power BI DAX. Minia function is nothing but it returns the smallest value in the column. Okay, syntax also very similar to min function, minia of column. Whatever the column you want to find the min value, you just mention the column name. Return value also, the smallest value. Here some remarks are there. The minia function takes as argument as a column that contains numbers and determines smallest value as follows. If the column contains no values, minia returns zero. But min function it doesn't return zero that is the difference and rows in the column that evaluates to logical values such as true and false are treated as one if true and uh, zero if it is false okay don't worry i will explain empty cells are ignored if you want to compare the text values use min f min function okay this function is not supported for use in direct query mode and uh, when you use it in calculated columns or row level security applied. That means this function is not support uh, if you are using um, direct query mode. You cannot create calculated columns and uh, if it is applied uh, row level security, it won't work. They given two examples many of numbers fright fright is the number and uh, postal code this is also number okay now let me go to my power bi desktop first of all let me load simple data to explain this scenario better let me click. don't worry it won't take much time to load I am taking min a and uh, product sorry products table okay this table contain dates also let me click on load now my tables are loaded into the power bi desktop in memory Now come to data view. So I am taking product table now. Okay. So here numbers are there. So first of all, I want to check whether it works for numbers or not. They give an example, but take new column. I just mentioned min a uh, number okay for better understanding min a of uh, quantity products of quantity okay it returns minimum value from this quantity 
column for numbers now i want to test for the text text uh, product name have the text new column min a text equal to min a products of product name it returns 0 see so if you put min function here it returns a see here so that means it won't work for the text i just want to keep as it is and i want to check for the dates new column min a dates equal to min a of products of dates it returning the uh, minimum date uh, from this uh, date column okay so it is working for the dates no issues and i want to check see here function will work for the logical values like true and false if true it returns 1 if false it returns 0 okay now come to this table see here uh, logical value 1 true it contains true it contains false okay right click I just mentioned min a true min a logical value 1 now see it returns 1 now I want to take one more column min a false min a logical value 2 logical value 2 column contains false that means it returns 0 so min a function will work for numbers dates and uh, logical values okay but it text that is the difference so in this way we can use min a function in different scenarios okay now i want to show microsoft provided these examples also okay for these examples we need to connect with the sql server let me connect to my sql server if anybody watching first time a video please check class number 3 and 4 why because in class number 3 and 4 i clearly explain how to download and install adventure works dw 2017 on the north wind database if you practice this database you will get familiar with the real world data that's the reason why i'm telling okay now i am taking fact internet sales only this table is enough to show this example that's the reason why i'm taking only one table just click on load click on ok import is always faster than direct query mode if you load multiple tables into the power bi desktop if the tables having in relationship then we will automatically 
detect the relationship very important point to understand that okay that's the reason why i'm repeating in every video now come here sales amount is there so and uh, freight also is there total freight also is there but i want to find minimum freight amount uh, from this uh, okay this column contains numbers don't confuse if you want you can check here also you come here and uh, you can directly you can uh, okay i want to find out the minimum value from this uh, freight amount okay now take a measure i just mention min a freight equal to min a freight fact internet sales of freight drag to report view let me convert to card to display the number okay this is the minimum value from the total freight amount okay and the second example is here min a of postal code now right click new measure min a postal code okay my measure name equal to min a of if you have code then only it will give before applying you need to check the column here fact internet sales these are the columns there is no postal code okay just i want to check for uh, date key if you have such kind of data then you can apply okay now drag to now you can convert to card to display the number date with time okay it returns so in this way you can implement uh, in different different scenarios mini a function okay thank you for watching my video if anybody wants special training on this power bi you can directly email to this email or you can directly call to this mobile number my whatsapp number also same number thank you for watching my video